all right now here we have received an exciting update for one hand operation plus which is a very useful application from goodlock labs this app enables us to control the phone with just one hand we can add different swipe gestures to execute some actions on the phone using just one hand the version number here is 5.3.31.0 and in the change log we have got very exciting points mentioned here we have an all new feature widgets pop up which is kind of cool i'm going to show you that in a minute uh, then we have got support for one ui 4.1.1 and android 12 l this update is meant for the large screen devices like tablets however we can expect some new features being added to the regular phones also with this all new one ui 4.1.1 Anyways, now let me show you widget pop-up feature which has been added with this all new update. Let's open this application. As you can see, we have got left handle, right handle on which we can set different actions. Uh, let me just tap on left handle here. We have got all these swipe and swipe and hold gestures to which we can assign the actions. Now this all new feature is one such action which has been added onto the list. Let me show you that. Let me just tap on a straight right. As you can see, we have got the list of swipe actions here. As we scroll down, we can see an all new option here, which is widgets pop up. Now this is something really cool. Let's just select this. Now what happens is when I swipe from the left side of the screen, widgets pop up will open up. Let's see that. Let me go to home screen. I will just swipe from the left. Here it is. We have got this pop up which shows the widgets that you are going to set on it. Now, of course, you will have to customize this widget pop up view. You will have to set all the widgets that you need. As you can see, I have set some system widgets here, such as calendar, device care widget, and I also have set a third party widget from KWGT widget app. We can also add more widgets to the next page. As you can see, I can swipe and see the other widgets here. In fact, I have set multiple pages here. Here we've got weather widget, gallery widget, and again, a third party widget here. We've got some additional widgets here from uh, device care as well as digital well-being. Here I've got calendar widget and some third party widgets as well. And in the fourth page, I have got more widgets here. Now let me just show you how to add widgets. I will just press and hold on the open space here. As you can see, we have an option add page or remove. I'll tap on add page and here is an all new page that we have got. Now here, just press and hold. You will see a pop up again. Here we have delete page, add widget, pop up size. When you tap on pop-up size, we can increase or decrease it by 4x1, 4x2, 4x3, 4x4, 4x5. Now this large pop-up is because I have set 4x5. If you want to reduce the size of this pop-up, you can reduce it to maybe 4x2 or 4x3. Depending on your preferences, you can do that. To add widget, just tap on this add widget option. Select the widget you want here and tap on the widget. The widget will get added on this pop-up view. Now you can reduce or increase the size of the widget inside here. Just press and hold on it and drag the widget from the borders. Now this is just fantastic. If you are into widgets and if you don't want all those widgets to be set on the home screen, this feature allows you to set all those widgets onto the pop-up view to make your home screen clutter free. Now there is one caveat here on this feature. Every time you open this pop-up view, it starts from the first page, which means let's say if you have opened the second page, the next time you open it, you will not be able to see the same page. It starts right from the first page. And I don't see any settings for that here to see the page where you have left. Maybe in the future update, Samsung can add this feature. Certainly a very useful feature the GoodLock team has added on one hand Operation Plus application. Now I have made a separate video on how to set different gestures. There are about seven cool gestures which I have set on my phone. If you have missed that video, I will leave a link for that in the description. Go ahead and check that out. Let me know what do you think about this update. Do share your thoughts in the comment section below. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, go ahead, smash that subscribe button and smash that like button if you find this video useful. Thanks a lot for watching. My name is Salyan signing off. You guys take care and stay safe. Cheers. Bye-bye.